Hi, I want to run through and see what all my microphones sound like. I use them a lot, but I've never compared each one to the other. And you might benefit because uh, some of this is high-grade professional equipment, and some of it is relatively inexpensive and easy to use. So first off, I'm using a lavalier, Audio-Technica lavalier, with a wireless broadcaster that goes to a transceiver on my video camera and that's how this sounds and then this is a they still make this this is an electro voice uh, 635a and it's a broadcast kind of um, interview mic news reporters use this it's also used on stage it's a condenser mic and what's interesting about that is it gets its own power from the sound pressure your voice so it's relatively insensitive and that's really good in noisy situations because you um, dial it in so it has the right uh, sound level for the person's voice and it's actually going to exclude the sound in the background which is much less loud and so they use this vocally a lot you know on stage or you use the Shure microphones and um, the singer is yelling in here, so the sound level is set very low. And that kind of isolates it from the other music. And it can be used uh, when you're recording in a noisy situation or you're interviewing somebody at a fire. So this is the sound of me talking through the Sennheiser ME80. And this is a shotgun mic. It's used a lot in television production, you know, hanging over the head uh, on a boom and there's usually a boom operator holding it right over the person's head and uh, it has a very focused range to get the sound straight ahead and exclude a lot of the sound from around it they're very good this is a um, has a battery in it and so that allows it to go right into the camera without uh, phantom power and uh, that makes life a lot easier and it has very good sound i think all right so this mic is actually a uh, headset that i'm wearing i bought it for 13 dollars on amazon it had very good reviews for sound quality and i'm testing it right now to hear if that's true it's the panasonic rp tcm 125-kb $13.55. It sounds great in the earbuds. Let's see how the mic sounds. So this microphone is the Rode Video Micro and it costs about $50 and it's very good to put on a digital SLR or your phone if you're doing selfies and things like that. With the microphone about two feet away, it sounds great, I think, for voice. And uh, it's a nice mic. It also doesn't have an on-off switch, which is a plus because so often with the more expensive mics, if you forget to turn it on, you've blown your whole shoot. And uh, sound is like the most important thing in a shoot in any case. Uh, so I rely on this quite a bit. This is the Boya Lavalier, which is on a long wire. I don't know whether it's uh, 15 feet long or something like that takes a battery which you use if you put it into a camera you can leave the battery off if you're using it into a cell phone and it does have i think pretty good sound quality it's very easy to use costs about thirty dollars which is wonderful the main hassle is the wire because you can um, it's a hassle to use you've got to run the wire up somebody's dress or whatever it is and um, also if they walk away they're going to tear the camera down and uh, so you have to be careful like that but on the other hand uh, wireless lavaliers have the problem of running into radio frequency interference and these never do so wired sound usually is always going to be better unless you spend a lot of money on your wireless equipment in any case great bargain lavalier Okay, so this is a recording microphone 
this is the Zoom H2. They now have the H2N, which I guarantee you is better and easier to use because the menus on this are really difficult. But it's a great sounding mic, and I've used this a lot. It's always good to have a secondary mic source just in case anything goes wrong anywhere else, and I use this Zoom for that quite a bit. I think it has great sound and it actually sounds good for music too. So now I'll turn that off. And over here I have the Tascam recorder, which uh, takes two XLR inputs so you can record uh, right into it and use it. But it also has its own microphones. So you can use it like the Zoom to record directly into it on an SD card. And it sounds really good. I want to hear if it sounds better than my Zoom. But it is a great little recorder and very useful. This microphone is the Razer Siren Mini. It's a USB mic that plugs directly into the computer. I think it sounds great. I've listened to the Yeti and the Snowball, things like that, that cost $100. Uh, and I just think this sounds a lot better. Cost uh, $50 on Amazon. Somehow I got it on sale for $30. All the better for me. But uh, a great microphone for Zoom calls and webcasts.